what is a situation ship, people? Well, according to BetchesLoveThis.com, <laughs> so which I love, I um, they say, quote, if you've been dating for longer than two months, and he said something like, or she, okay, and she said something like, I'm not looking for anything serious, but you're spending Sunday fun day together, and you've met his or her guy friends, girlfriends, possibly ex-girlfriends, boyfriends as well, then you are in a situation ship. Also, another example, if his or her text response rate is less than 60% and disappears for a week at a time, but you're his or her plus one at every wedding and they bought you a Christmas gift, you are in a situation ship. So it's more than friends with benefits, but it's not an exclusive relationship. That's what it is. The author of the piece also stated that it's not really sustainable because eventually you're either going to want to evolve into a relationship or you got to cut the ties. Thoughts, five words or less. Careful. Situationships can become situationships. Oh. It's time to move on. Dump! Dump, 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 dump. <laughs> no. Somebody's not committing. I think that's what it boils mm. down to. Mm -hmm. You know, and they're trying to make themselves feel better by calling it a situationship. So mm. just call it what it is. I don't necessarily know. Yeah, I, I guess you, I don't know. I just feel Murky. like that, I feel like somebody's more into the other person. That's what I'm envisioning yeah. in any situation ship and that the other person's using the situation ship and eventually somebody's feelings gets hurt. Just sex. <laughs> it never works, bro. I don't know. Of course, of course. Yeah. But, you know, is it the worst thing in the world? No. no. So, in fact, I feel like it's kind of the way dating is now. <laughs> it's like, I really like you right now and I, I want this to work out, but at the same time, I'm kind of keeping my options open in case somebody that's not better, but somebody that's more right for me comes along. I'm sure it was fine for her, but I need more. And you're honest about the whole time. Yeah. So that's why I think it's okay. Because exactly. you are saying, listen, I can't commit to you, but why not get the person a Christmas gift? So I kind of like the idea that it's more than friends with benefits because you're developing at least an appreciation for that person. There's a yeah. man mind here where it's like, I know her, I should get her a Christmas gift. And then there's a woman mind, which is like, he got me a Christmas gift. What does it mean? What color is the wrapping paper? I think green means he loves me. You love me. You really love me. See, I feel like it's the opposite. <laughs> really? Yeah, yeah. I think it's both. I think it can happen either I'm way. I'm saying if a, yeah, guys probably won't buy you a Christmas gift. Exactly. But I don't know. We're, we're all different kinds of stupid. Idiot. There's no one kind of stupid that really encapsulates the male condition. So some of us are stupid because we don't buy Christmas gifts, and some of us are stupid because we do and don't realize what that means. Ooh. Lauren, do you, what do you think about a situation ship? Do you think that it exists, number one, and B, is it something that can be sustainable, in your opinion? I mean, I, I definitely think it has existed, and I've existed in that situation ship, but I, it's not something that I would actually like or did like, and it's always one person liking the other person more. So if, if you're in a situation ship and, and that, that guy is the one who's not committing, then I'd say move on. I'm so glad you said that because I do think that one of the people in that situation ship are holding out. Oh, definitely. Like, oh, I'm going to change their mind or eventually they'll come around. And there is going to be a period of time where you're going to have to ask them, okay, either we're in an exclusive relationship or not. And if they can't give that to you, that's not their fault. They really can't give that to you, but then it's time to move on. And I think that's what you have to, you know, decide. That's the hardest part is that even if you are honest with somebody about it and say, this is where I'm at, I'm not looking for a relationship, but I do want to keep hanging out with you, it it sucks because yeah. you lose no matter what. Damned if you do, damned if you don't. Seriously. Yep. And I mean, and as far as the gift thing goes, it's like sometimes gifts just mean please keep having sex with me and mm -hmm. nothing more. <laughs> Don't analyze. I, this sounds like the kind of word that's in the woman's toolbox that they use to classify their problems, but I don't think guys are gonna know what the hell you're talking about when you say situation <laughs> And I don't think anyone wants to classify it on Facebook as a situation Right, yeah, yeah, exactly. Okay, what do you guys think about a situation ship? Do you believe it exists? Have you been in a situation ship? Please share your thoughts in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe. Also, make sure that you like us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter.